Matt Granger for Photo News and Reviews. Robotized photography. Does that mean I'm out of a job? Hello. Like in that sample, what this is really about is taking multiple camera angles that give you a live kind of effect in your shot. Photo Robot have all these dollies and systems for rotating objects like this pair of jeans on a tiny little rig through to this much bigger one that's for a person to be able to actually walk on. And then this one, which is now set up as a dining room, but that's actually to put full-size cars on. They have ginormous soft boxes that surround it. And then you have a single camera fixed in place. As the car turns, you get multiple angles on it. So here we have another one of the, the rotating plates that they use. And then here is a multi-cam arm. So this has four Canon cameras hooked up on it to all the way over the top. And down in the arm is the wiring that controls all the controls of the camera from the main station. So then you can shoot it static and have each of the cameras shooting a different angle. So then you can get top down on the camera or side on or all these different angles. But then you can rotate it as well to get all of those angles from each different side. So this is the control center for the multicam setup. And I'll show you a close up on the screen, but you can control everything on each one of the cameras, including the focus and when they're gonna shoot and all of that kind of thing, go in on zoom, on live view and that kind of thing to get it all set up before you actually hit the button and take all the shots. So on this one, you can click through each one of the different camera views and that's actual live view. They're not recorded images. That's what the cameras are looking at of the car right now. So then you can go in and zoom right in to five times and move it around, say the wheels are the most important thing. And you can actually pull focus in the shot in the live view. So I can control, well, the software allows you to control the focus in the shot. So pulling back out. So, and I guess you can move your focus point around. Yeah, here we go. So pretty high tech stuff, really. Okay, so the tech's just gonna set it up now to shoot uh, more angles on the camera. Oh, here it goes. I just heard something. And here's the result. So you can see loads of different angles at different rotation points. And if you have more and more angles and more increments in between each one, it gives you that 3D realistic effect because it's like it's moving around in real time. Here we did it in much bigger increments. As sexy as that Hummer is, I think we can do a little bit better. Here's Hana, a Czech model who's come along to play Angry Birds and get some photos taken. Uh, respect to the makeup artist, I'm sure that wasn't an easy job. So the, the point of this one is, with her walking on this moving ground, is that you would shoot it on a green screen all around with a, you know, the camera fixed in one position as she keeps moving, and then you can superimpose any background on there you want, and it gives the impression of showing whatever garment it is that you're trying to show off being shown on a catwalk from 360 degrees with a mohawk with your boobs out. So can't complain about that at all. Okay, so the company started off about six years ago in the Czech Republic with just a single turntable and an idea. And it's grown and grown and grown. This is their third photo, Kina. And now they have distributors all through Europe and America. And they sell all around the world. Their, their business isn't actually taking the photos. It's selling the hardware for other people to take their own photos and the software just comes along as part of the package. So you can see there's lots of different applications. Obviously, if I had to choose, I'd rather shoot Hana than a Hummer. But um, yeah, you can certainly see there'll be a lot of applications in, especially in garments, but any kind of manufacturing where you want to show a 3D uh, conceptualization of the actual product from every single different angle and have them be able to just play it through or animate it as an actual video. It's a pretty nifty little idea, and I'm quite liking this little turntable. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. There's lots more photo news and reviews coming soon. I'm trying to think of a pun. I can think of that Kylie Minogue song, but if I sing it, that's copyright. Hmm. Hana's got me in a head spin? No. I got nothing. I got nothing except a little bit of dizziness.